the wait is over. There are few bigger days on the football calendar than Champions League final day. Fans are beginning to pour into the stadium and the tension is palpable. It's Leipzig, they face Manchester City and it's live. This is where every top-level footballer wants to be after a long season. The Champions League final. Only two teams left in the battle for Europe's Premier Club competition. My name is Derek Ray, and I'm joined for commentary on this final tonight by Stuart Robson. It's RB Leipzig facing Manchester City. Well, what a night, Derek. Two great teams, a perfect pitch, a magnificent stadium, and millions watching around the world. What more could you ask for, apart from maybe different commentators? Have a look at the starting 11 for Leipzig. Well, the 4 4 2 system relies on good combinations all over the pitch. The front two, the central midfield pairing, the full back and winger, and of course the centre backs. If you can get these combinations right, you'll have a good team. Needs to tread carefully. Well, far from the ideal pass. Oh, he's through here. And in it goes. Manchester City strike for in the Champions League final. Well, here's the replay. And sometimes when you're being pressed high up the field, you have to go that little bit longer and not play out through the thirds. And that's what they tried to do here. They had their pocket picked and suddenly they find the ball in the back of the net. And Leipzig get us moving again. A quick reply required after the disappointment of conceding. Simakon. Gundogan. De Bruyne waiting. It comes to nothing in the end. And the keeper more than equal to it. Kevin De Bruyne with the corner. Grealish. Well, that wasn't a simple save to make. Trying to deliver it accurately. And the goal kick will be next. Really good high press. Hold on! He knew he had to make the tackle and did. Good to one wilting under the pressure and now they try to go forward well let's see what they have in store for them on the break can they keep it going well it fizzled out and Kunku this could square the game but the keeper has his say and how important could that be in the grand scheme of things? Well, that was a big chance, and really, he should have taken that. But let's give credit to the goalkeeper. It's a decent save. Now, sending it in. And the danger's still on. And Kunku. Giving it a try. 
And that wasn't a million miles away, almost the equaliser. Well, it's not a bad effort, is it? But they've got to find a way back into this one. Grealish. Holland. And they continue to advance. And a lot of and with tackling like that. The onus is on the referee to take action, potentially. Well, he's gone into the book. Well, he was late and he deserved the booking for that. takes it away and the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack will it be sufficiently imaginative Forsberg not an attempt that will live long in the memory well what a waste that is it's far too easy for the keeper well City haven't lost the possession as you can see but what they've done with it has been really good and they'll be happy with the way the game is being played at the moment. Oh, Stuart, they might be onto something here. Majestic piece of goalkeeping. Well, he loves the big moments, doesn't he? And he's proved it again there. Great goalkeeping. Can someone get on the end of this? And collected tidily. He had plenty to think about. Laporte. On to Holland. So nearing the break, and City hold the edge. Stuart, how about your critique of what they put into the game so far? Well, they've worked hard and played well to be in front here, but they now need to keep their focus as we approach half-time. And gobbled up with ease by the keeper. Grealish. Grealish. He's got a bad ball. Well, here's the replay, and just look how quickly they break forward once they win the ball back. But how is he allowed that much time and space? He doesn't even have to jump to head it in. It's a good finish, but terrible defending. So the ball rolling again. 2-0 the score. And a poor ball. And Kunku, can he get one back? Keeper did his job to begin with. And unable to pick out a teammate. And that'll be a throw. Grealish. Nathan Ake here. Laporte. Diesch. The first half here comes to an end. And they're under... Five minutes separating these two sides from glory. The second half of the Champions League final begins. Given away by Ilkay Gundogan. He continues his run. Now no mistake from the keeper acting decisively. Gundogan. Riyad Mahrez. And a strong tackle. Leipzig unable to retain possession.
And Leipzig in a position of menace. Couldn't quite hang on. Danger averted for now. Rodri. Kevin De Bruyne. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. Mares. Is it going to be Riyad Mares? Oh, a smart stop. They will now make use of their substitutes bench. Who can he pick out? Pretty comfortable piece of defending. Andre Silva. Orban. Mohamed Simakon. On the ball, Schlager. Vidi Orban. Nkunku. Might be able to set up the chance. Nkunku. And it's gone behind for the corner. <laughs> Played over. And a struggle to get it away properly. And Kunku. And a throw in here for Leipzig. No possibilities inside the box. Timely intervention. And possibilities here. On to Holland. And the counter attack is on. Options available. Well, so many possibilities, but it didn't happen for them. Andres Silva and offside just as he was ready to pounce a quarter of an hour remaining here oh bruising past him and it's two for him today a masterful performance the defenders unable to stop him Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. But the keeper should do better at his near post. That's gone in far too easily. That's not good goalkeeping. This is looking rather comfortable for them. 3-0. And all the way through it goes to the goalkeeper. Diesch. Ten minutes left for play. Poor attempt at a pass, really. Schlager. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Now, who can he play it to? Walker. And return to Mares. A danger here as he runs at them. In with a chance. And a fine stop. Well, adding up all the stoppages, we will have two extra minutes. Holland, fantastic work to thwart the danger. And there it is, full-time Manchester City Champions League winners. Well, just look at the emotions out there.